Hey you guys, welcome back to Let's Play Silent Hill 1. Forgive the odd opening, but uh, I just got a call from a guy who always says that, and he just got out of jail for assault, actually. Which is another story altogether, but I won't tell it here. So yeah, we're playing Silent Hill 1, and this is my billionth take of this opening, because I want to get through these first two rooms without being hit. And I have started this set so many times... Gotten hit on one of these first two rooms, and it's not gonna happen this time, I'll tell you that right now. now turn around and shoot! You gotta keep in the glitchy sound thing next time it comes up because people were wondering what it actually sounds like. So I will oblige you this one time, after that I'm gonna cut all the rest out for the rest of the video series. Die, 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 die. Yes, that's how you do it, bitch. Heck yeah, son. All right, folks, we're actually starting the Let's Play this time around. This is seriously like my 20th take at that. It's harder than it looks, that's all I'm saying. Run past that first room, get in here, dodge those guys, get to the corner end, and then shoot them all. Very difficult. All right. Now, I know I said I'd get right back up to where I died last time, but actually I did have a bit to go through because I last saved the bus. So I'd go through that whole opening bit, get all the items there, save at the infirmary, and then I'd just try this over and over again until I did it. But- it Oh, fuck you! Oh, fuck you! There's only the one of them. Fuck that! Die, you stupid mother fucker! Mm, giving you beats! Mm, mm. I hate these kids! Mm. Alright. We can continue with the let's play now. Stupid little sons of bitches. It's locked. It's locked. Lock is jammed. Lock is jammed. Lock isn't jammed. Alright, now as I recall, that door there was locked. Now let's hope. Fuck! Fuck! We're taking another run at that. <laughs> I apologize for all the obscenities, but this game, this game is hard. Alright, that room is just completely blocked off. Remember that, for folks. Go! Oh, there are two of them! There are two of them! Dude, this is tough! They're just like, <laughs> last game was easy, or last two modes were easy, weren't they? Other designers like, yeah, they were! Let's just throw in a son of a bitch of a lot of enemies. Lock is jammed. Please tell me one of these actually opens. Alright, I remember there are no items in the room that actually have the guy in them. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into this one, where there are no guys, and there are still no items. Maybe it's in the other world with their items in one of these. I don't know. Get in the- Go! Oh, bullshit! I- Oh, it's unlocked! See, thanks, game. Thanks. It gypped me. Did you see that? Pure jippage. That's not even a word. You won't find that in any spell checker, but come on. On. What's up with that? Alright. 
Now, it's going to be far easier just to go around this way. I was certain those doors open. Maybe in hard mode they don't open. Or maybe I'm confusing them with the other world. That's the problem with this game, is that there are two versions of every level, so... A lot of times I might get confused. As to which order you go in the rooms. Alright, well let's go up this way. Looks like we have to go up these stairs. They just put in a shit ton of enemies. Damn. I'm angry now. I'm cussing all the time. Eight enemies. Freaking suck, man. Oh no, run away, Harry. Let's try out this door. Of course. And there's gonna be one around this side too. Come on, Harry! No! How many how are you supposed to get through here? I just want a simple answer. How are you supposed to get through here with this many freaking enemies? They're all over the place. Look at this! There's one there's you're putting cramped spaces, and then you got a guy coming from each side. The only way you could have gotten through that is the one guy on the one side was a little bit delayed. So you have to just play through this game and die over and over until you've memorized the layout. Even playing through on the easier difficulty won't help you because the enemy uh, layout has changed. They change what enemies go where. Well, they didn't change what enemies go where. They have the same enemies there as before. They just added in a ton more. But you get what I'm saying, folks. You understand. There better be bullets in one of these. Yeah, you got any bullets in there? No, no bullets. Oh, well. I'm right next to the doors and you can't see because of the camera angle. This is... You need to die. Oh, two of them?! I don't care how much ammo it weighs. I'm sick of this dungeon right now, I'll tell you that. I'll tell you that for free. Die! Okay, die? Was I not stomping him there? Did you folks not see that? Alright, I think I got slightly more ammo than I wasted out of that. Which makes it kind of worth it? And I got some satisfaction out of it, I'll tell you that. Stupid little kid monsters. Get in there, Harry. Yes, thank you for unlocking it. Now go. Go in there. Whew. We can't actually do anything in here yet, so let's just leave. Run, Harry! Get in there! This game is hard! Go, Harry! They dive for you! They dive! How are you supposed to deal with enemies that dive? I can't wait till I get to the freaking hospital and can get my good weapons. Oh, get out of my... I can't believe I didn't get hit a second time there. I can't wait till I get to the freaking hospital. Oh, better not be one of those stupid little kids in there. I'm gonna blow your freaking head. Oh, it's just a kitty. Meow has joined your party. Poor Meow. Let's need to find freaking Odin. Get him in here. Yeah, how a little kid's gonna like that? Freaking Odin with his gun. Oh, shit. Please tell me this door opens. Thank you. Go back out, Harry! There's nothing down here, is there? Nope. Okay, go down the stairs, Harry! I don't even know where I'm going. Strategy is left at this point. <laughs> I'm just heading towards the nearest exit. Oh, come on, you stupid little son of a... I'm tempted to smack him with my pipe, but I know another enemy's around here somewhere. 
please tell me there's... Oh, thank you. This door opens. There better be something in here. That's all I'm gonna say. There be something... There's nothing in here. I did have at least one guy actually apologize for sending me into this stupid hard mode. It's alright, I accept your apology. Who are you? I'm Harry Mason. Who? You? Now, I've never actually looked at these before. Man. So I think that's what it says. Harry freaking Mason. Little punk. You don't mess with Harry Mason. He's totally okay with shooting little kids. We saw it. And beating them with pipes. I mean, that's hardcore. Most people would flinch before they beat a little kid to death with a pipe, but Harry Mason won't. He's like, hey, tried to grab my leg. I don't put up with that. Well, I like Harry Mason. Okay, so that looks like that's settled. We can't go down to the basement yet. So... It looks like that's the room we need to go into up there. The lab equipment area, chemistry, all that. And, uh... Yeah, we'll see what happens from there. So we'll run across. What am I doing on healing items? Seven, three... Oh, man, this is bad. Oh, I am so glad this door opened. You have no idea. Distilled water, no reason to take it. That's odd, I don't know why that's in there. Because those are... I mean, everything else kind of blends in with the background. I mean, they're not, like, specifically rendered, or there's, like, a bunch of stuff that all looks the same. Distilled water, that kind of stands out, actually. And he actually mentions it, distilled water. Sort of makes you wonder if there wasn't, like, a puzzle that involved distilled water at some point that they took out. And there's glucose. See, I sort of wonder if there wasn't, like, a, I don't know, sort of a Plant 42-ish puzzle in here that you had to do before. Go, Harry. I believe in you. Oh! How many guys are in this hallway? Look at this! Look at this! Oh, of course it's locked. Why wouldn't it be, right? Alright, my controller's vibrating. That means, yeah, dying again. Alright, stupid boy. Yeah, I'll use up some handgun ammo. Anyone else? want some because I will give it to them also no I don't trust trying to kick enemies while holding the gun I tend to accidentally shoot them so that's why I always pull out the melee weapons in case you're wondering I better just shoot him to be safe yeah I lost a bullet out of it but Better than losing health at this point. I have way more. I'm nearly full on handgun ammo as it happens. So. Die! 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 Can't wait till I get to the hospital. I want that hospital. Friend in need. By the way, folks, we're eventually going to get to a hospital. That's my favorite level tell you why. The best weapon in the game in that level. When I get it, it's going to make it so much easier. You know, I, I'll even love the fact that there are way more enemies there, just because you can show off that weapon. 
I clear out the hospital. It's brutal, but awesome. And gun ammo, I'll take that. I'm gonna need to really just start unloading, just absolutely unloading on these guys. Because you do get quite a bit of ammo still left in this stage. I know especially in the other version of it, so... You guys need to remind me to just let loose. I'm used to playing Resident Evil where it's better to just run away. Not so much in this game, actually. Anyway, in order to get this, um, the, uh, there's a hand clasping that, as the, I think I showed you there. And, uh, yeah, you pour the chemical on it, and it melts. Oh, son of a... It's alright, I'm never coming back here again, and there's only one since I cleared out the entire freaking area. is we're going to head in here. Aha! See, and there's no one in here. Okay, maker. Alright. A. I should have got a little blood on the A there, but whatever. I do wonder if there's anything in there, but there's not. I know one of these classrooms is supposed to have hand grenades somewhere around the back. I think they remember something like that, but whatever. Just a little bit of hand grenade ammo isn't really that helpful. If it were a health drink, I'd be searching all over the place for it. I'll tell you that for free. Alright, you stupid little kids, you want some? You want some of this? Fine, I'll give you some of this if that's what you want. You want some? I will give it to you. I will give it to you hard, man. I will give it to you so hard and so fast you won't even freaking... Ugh! Yeah, see what I did to your little friend there? Yeah, guess what's gonna happen to you? Oh, yeah. No one backs Harry Mason into a corner! Okay, actually hit him, Harry. Oh, that's right! I'll curb stomp a bitch! No one messes with Harry Mason. Anyone else got a problem? Because I would love it! No, oh, y'all scared, huh? Yeah! Ain't fun when Harry Mason fights back, is it? what I thought, stupid little punks. Oh, that was skilled. <laughs> Did you guys see that? <laughs> that was skilled. I'll, I won't lie to you folks, I am impressed with that. Alright. Doesn't seem to be doing the audio glitch when I shoot these guys. I think I'm past the part of the game where it does it. But don't worry, when I get into the next overworld section, it'll start to do it again. I guarantee you it's going to happen at least once more for the uh, end of the LP. Alright! Clearing this area out, boy. Why'd I do that? I just need to go back out there. Guys respawn in this area. That pisses me off. I won't lie to you folks. That pisses me off. Maybe only one of them respawned. Think they'd throw me a bone and have that happen? Why would they respawn? Ugh. I 
Yeah, I actually thought they respawned in this area. But I thought, no, 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 no. Enemies don't respawn in the dungeons. I'm just being silly. Only when very specific plot things happen do enemies respawn in areas. But, nope! Screw me, right? Anyway, I think... I can't remember if... Yeah, I think it automatically opens up. Alright. Oh, at least as you can see, we are almost done with this area. By the way, there's no point going up to the third floor in this version of the dungeon, because I'll just tell it to you for free. There's nothing up there. You'll just find a door that says, The lock is broken and I can't open it. Who went around just smashing all the locks in this place? That's what I want to know. Someone did. Alright. Now that I wasted an ungodly amount of ammo there, we will now deliver the finishing blow to these stupid little kids. You stay down, boy! When I put you down, you stay- I TOLD YOU TO STAY DOWN! Oh. Yeah! Okay, now that we've dealt with that, we can move on. I'm gonna beat this game all the way through on hard mode. And I ain't using save states or none of that crap. I know a lot of people, I'm not gonna name any names, but a lot of people, they play these survival horror games and they use save states to make it look like they're better at it. Ain't I don't do the stuff like that. Alright, I did it on the uh, the World's Night Up for the Game Boy Color, but... That was a long time ago, and that was actually a really stupid game, so I didn't mind doing it. Alright. I did it on Fantasy Star 2, but you can save anywhere in that game, so... It's not really cheating, it's just slightly faster than going through the save menu. Alright, a tale of birds without a voice. Uh, first flew the greedy pelican, eager for the reward. White wings flailing. So, white. Uh, and eager for reward, flailing. Alright, so doesn't make it very far. Then came a silent dove, flying beyond the pelican as far as it could. Again, white, farther along than the first one. Alright, you may see... Let me take a few tries at this, but, uh, yeah, it, it doesn't really matter. There's no penalty for messing up. A raven, black, flies in, flying higher than the dove, so black higher, again. All right, white next to another one. And then black, so it's white, 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 black, white. And then the first one, so... Alright, there are going to be two white ones right next to each other. A white one further along. And then, okay. Wait. Oh. Alright, I see. Alright, so we do... Wait. Okay, so, one, so that was pelican, dove, raven, and, uh, swan, and there we go. See, when there are actually puzzles that make sense and require intelligence to solve, I can do pretty well. You know, a lot of people say I wasn't good at the puzzles in Silent Hill Shattered Memories, but if you look back, I think you'll find I actually knew how to solve 
most of them. It was that I didn't know how to implement it. Like, where I got stuck, like, especially with, like, that faucet one, I knew I had to turn on hot water to get steam to come up. I knew that. But I couldn't figure out was how to manipulate the faucet to correctly produce hot water. It was always the manipulation of the objects that proved to be my downfall. Alright. So now we gotta go back down. I'm gonna save at the infirmary on the way, because I don't want to die and lose all this progress we've made. Well, not we've made, because you're sitting at home laughing at me, saying, DO IT ON HARD MODE! Me, I'm actually doing the work. Oh shit, they can come up here! Run, Harry. Get out of my way. I was really kind of hoping that he would stop on the stairs. And there are enemies in here now. Great. Luckily, I'm not too dink banged up. Die. If there's a third guy that comes up and attacks me, I'm gonna be upset. Oh! I don't feel too bad about using up all my handgun ammo now, because I'm going to find another weapon. And I'm pretty sure the hospital is the next level, actually. Which is really going to take care of a lot of problems for me. So I'm not going to be using it, needing to use firearms nearly as much on these little guys. And the handgun's not really even any good against bosses, so... Come on. You know what? I'm just going to run past you because we're almost actually done. I hate you. There is only one of them here now. So, I guess it was worth something. I guess kill just one of them and maybe... I don't know if you have to kill both of them to only get one of them in here. Or maybe you can just kill the one of them. If so, just kill the one of them because I think that makes it a little bit easier. Alright, basically what we need to do is, obviously, we need to come over here. Put that in. I don't know where he I know I'm going to turn around. He's going to be right there. Harry, get him around there, Harry. Thank you. It's a handy these little kids can't run. Um, we need to go to the other one. kids. Get out of my way. That was the wrong direction. Damn. Go! Oh! Ho, ho, ho! Harry Mason! Father! Badass! Ninja! Oh, yeah, son. All right. Now, you'd think the scary basement would be, like, the sort of place where you'd get really hard and really hellish, and it's not. Here's a switch. Do you want to press it? Yep. Unless you're afraid of switches. Basement ain't that scary. What the hell was that? Yeah, probably just machinery. All right. So basically what you need to do is you need to put those two medallions in there. You come down here, you hit the button, and you can go up to the clock tower. I would have spent more time examining the clock tower, but there are enemies in that area, and I am not going to spend time exploring areas with enemies. I'll tell you that for free. Going to try and lure him over this way. Ah, oh, that dive move! I hate it, I hate it, I hate it! I hate the dive! Oh man, look at my health items. Freaking. If you dive, you know what? Son of a bitch, I hate the dive move. That's how much I hate it.
hate the dive move. That is the most annoying move in any game. Aside from maybe that downward swoop those stupid pterodactyls have. Like, if they just swung with the knife, I would always be able to dodge them. It's because they got a massive reach with that dive. The reach is massive. Alright, let's head into the clock tower. I'm sure everything will be fine here. Just climb down this here ladder. You guys hear a siren? There's a siren in the background. It's weird. Keep out. Well, my daughter might be in there. Huh. Another ladder. That's weird. Hmm. It's kind of symmetrical. Kind of odd. And really, actually, this should be inside the school. This doesn't really make sense architecturally, because I should have come up inside of with the way it's built and how far I walked. Huh. Makes you wonder where I am.